What's up everybody? My name's Chris. I am the Casual Flipper, a reseller on Amazon, eBay. I'm very happy you stopped by my channel today. I hope you enjoy it. Today we're gonna dive into how to get unrestricted in categories on Amazon. Let's let this intro go so we can get into the content of the episode. So I'm gonna start this off really easy just by saying do not overcomplicate this or make it harder than it needs to be. This is a pretty straightforward concept. It's not gonna require you to spend $500 or even $100 for that matter. And it's not gonna require a ton of time. The first thing you have to do if you wanna get ungated in the category is just click request approval. And some of the time, a small portion of the time, you'll be auto approved, which is amazing when that happens. Now, if it doesn't happen, which it probably won't in the major categories, at least right away, you have to submit an invoice. Now don't overcomplicate or overthink this, pro, this part of the process because it's not that bad. This isn't about profitability. I'm not trying to find a wholesaler or distributor to become profitable off of and make a bunch of money. This is purely about getting unrestricted or ungated in a category. So just go to Google, type in grocery distributor in Texas, in Halifax, in Vancouver, in Phoenix, wherever you live, and contact the ones that show up on the list. If you don't find any profitable products, big deal. All you need is that invoice. This applies to all the different categories. You can find profitable wholesalers, distributors down the road. This is just what open up those categories. Now, the other thing is you don't have to worry about minimums. Find a distributor that has like a $50 minimum or a $25 minimum. I got ungated in grocery in Canada and the US on a $50 invoice, all right? I see people out there selling this service for $500, which blows my mind. I get ungated in toys for 80 bucks. So this isn't, you don't have to have these huge orders. They put a minimum in there. Sometimes the minimum can be as low as five, maybe even one unit is all you need. It just needs to be from a wholesaler or distributor that is authorized and reputable. Now, the other key thing I'm gonna throw at you is while you're doing this, filling out the application, don't leave the comments blank. Put in something along these lines. Dear Amazon, I'm, an, I'm a serious seller. No, don't put that. I might cut that or I might leave it in. Put in Dear Amazon, here's invoice from X, the most trusted, largest distributor in my area. As you can see, I'm purchasing X quantity of X directly from them and will continue to do so in the future. Here's my account number, here's their number. Put something in there that's professional, maybe more fluid than that, I'm just making it up on the spot. But the whole idea is in the comments to show that you're a serious seller and that you're professional and you're working with other professionals who are gonna provide a good service and product for their customers. So don't leave that, that place blank. Make sure you have the proper quantity. And then the other thing you wanna make sure of is that you are actually providing invoice from an authorized distributor wholesaler okay this means you can't go to target or toys r us or whatever and get ungated using receipts these are invoices so there's a difference there you got to make sure the names match up the addresses match up to what's on your seller censure account that's all very important and the final thing i want to tell you is just because you get rejected doesn't mean that you did something wrong you don't know who's on the other end of this. I applied to grocery three times, I got approved on my third. So that just means the first and second were rejected for reasons I'm not sure of. So if you're confident that you have all the proper documentation, keep applying. I wouldn't apply more than three times, but apply those three times. And if you're still getting rejected, there may be something that we have to do to get you approved. But just because you get rejected that one time, don't give up. So the key points, Find your authorized wholesaler or distributor. Purchase the minimum quantity, whatever that is, one, five, 10. Make some good comments, dear Amazon, whatever. And don't get frustrated or give up if you get rejected. I hope these points help you in your journey of finding wholesaler distributors. I hope this helps you get ungated in categories and I hope you have a very good day. If you enjoy my content or this channel, hit that like, hit subscribe, leave a comment, and be sure to check out a reseller Discord server that I made. It's where resellers can ask questions, even like this, how do, you get, how do I get and get in toys? Someone will answer it in there for you. I'll leave the Discord in the show notes. I hope you enjoy this. Be well, keep crushing it, and stay real.